This is less paperwork involved in a real estate transaction for a cash buyer. I mean, yes. And um, so not when you do the offer to purchase and, you know, real estate commission, office procedures or whatever, you, you pretty much still have the same amount of paperwork. The only difference in paperwork, if, um, if you showed on the offer to purchase that you're going to be utilizing a mortgage, then you usually have to have some kind of pre-qualification to attach with that. If you're going to tell, tell a seller, I need a loan to buy your property, I've already been through the process, so here you go. So, you know, that's a little bit more, but um, where there's a lot more paperwork is at the real estate closing. So it's, it's much, much less paper to sign at the closing. I, told, I tell my residential mortgage buyers uh, that they're probably, I tell them to loosen up their forearm because they're, they're going to be signing their name probably like 50 to 70 times. There's a lot, a lot of paperwork uh, as far as that's concerned. But um, as far as, as far as the, the seller's concerned, you know, it's not really less, less complicated. The seller has to do the same thing. That's what's always so cute about uh, being a, a land person and the carry agent calls me up and says, we're making an offer and it's cash. Well, okay, that's great, but you know, first of all, it's land. You pretty much have to do cash, anyways. And you know, I mean, I just I had one good old country boy in Bennett said, uh, Eric, I get the same amount of money if it's cash or mortgage. I mean, he's getting cash when he sells the land, even if you get, even if you found somebody to do a mortgage. Guess what he gets? Cash. I mean, you know, it's just, uh, people think it's that. So, I, you know, one of the areas that becomes less complicated is, I mean, does a cash buyer still get a home inspection? Yes. Do they still want to see if the land perks? Yes. So, you know, the fact that their cash doesn't make that process less complicated. <clears throat> Are, is the buyer going to get an appraisal if they're cash? I mean, they're not prohibited from getting an appraisal. You know, just because they're paying cash doesn't mean they can't. It's rare, but you know, they could still get an appraisal. So that's one less hoop that we'd have to jump through or whatever. But um, uh, I think I think some people overemphasize how um, big of a deal uh, a cash a cash purchase. I mean, there's still good things about it. And, and the biggest thing is in this escalating market, there are things that wouldn't appraise. And if that, if that buyer doesn't have the ability to make up that deficiency, that's where it can be. But um, not a huge difference between cash and mortgage until you get to the signing table.